Ladies, I am here with... Gabby. Joy. Hi, Gabby and Joy. My name is Samantha. Hi, Samantha. Do you cook a lot? I do. What about um, breakfast? Who has eaten yet? I just got a cute little thing that I don't know how to pronounce. So a stocked fridge, I'm assuming? Yeah. Pretty stocked fridge. It's a croissant with like a creme brulee. What can't she pronounce? What, what can't she pronounce? Okay. Can I come over and like look in your fridge? Oh. If I looked into your fridge right now, what would I see? Our fridge uh, is literally so disgusting. Um, if I gave you $100 cash, can I come over right now and see what's in your fridge? Only if you're wearing that shirt. Potentially, maybe. Yeah, it's fine. All right, let's go do it. Let's go do it. Vamanos. Come on in. Wow, so crazy to see you here. Is it a different day? Who knows? Am I wearing exactly the same thing? Who cares? Let me show you around my place. This is my work nook that I don't use because I work on the couch. Hey, over here. This is my breakfast nook that I've never eaten at because I eat on the couch. But let me show you where I keep my food, because this is what's in your fridge. All right, well, for $100, I'm gonna show you what's in my fridge. Let's go. Ah. Here on the top row, we have, honestly, a lot of things I don't use. But besides human food, we also have plant food. Famously, flowers are people too, you know? And then here on the second drawer is probably my most shameful shelf because it's all takeout containers, including now what I'm seeing is a completely empty takeout container. We have a little leftover Chinese roasted veggies that definitely need to be thrown out at this point. She wanted to have a word. And here, I think, is the staple of every bachelor's kitchen. It's an entire rotisserie chicken because you can eat it for dinner and then lunch and then dinner and then lunch. Here we have more takeout food, of course, um, just hiding even more varieties of seltzer and ignore the rogue mayonnaise. But I actually did want to show you a TikTok hack that I learned. The best way to put the seltzers into your fridge. So it's like, we don't wanna be putting them in one by one. We don't have the time. You take your new case, you open it up on both sides. You got the other side, you just push your hand through. I have saved hours, hours of my day. Now here we have three different kind of a collagen, green-like powders that I've honestly touched once, but they're so expensive, so I can't throw them out. Here we have the, um, the two things that sort of uh, help me stay alive. One is a probiotic, which apparently you're supposed to keep in the fridge. And here are some coffees. I can't misrepresent myself. These iced coffees are just the iced coffees you drink on the way to get your iced coffee outside. Up here, we have a couple eggs and also these fun little, you know these little shots, these like wellness shots that are like turmeric or vitamin C and like maybe they work, maybe they don't work, but it's one of those things where it's like you treat your body like for three days and you have one of these and you're like <laughs> cured. To help. What else? Oh, face masks. Keep your face masks in the fridge. Um, we got condiments. The freezer honestly is, I stocked up for quarantine and then like never used any of this stuff. So it's, it's, just, it's probably all expired. We got some uh, gyoza, we got some colorful cauliflower. Oh, another fun thing to keep in the freezer. Gua sha, I think that's how you say it, but also a really nice. These, dish <laughs> these these frozen pizzas have literally been here since like the first day that we were going on lockdown. So those probably need to go, but 
Oh, such fun things to look back at, you know, the nostalgia. What am I gonna do with my $100? Um, probably get more takeout. If you liked what you saw here today, I'm sure there are links. Click them, subscribe to Everything Taste Made, and we'll see you in a different video. Bye.